most of my background on this site, headwayvideos.com, it's transparent. Okay, and there's another video I have that I'll show you how to do that. Just search transparent on the this uh, Headway video site. Um, but what I want to do is I want to create one leaf, basically like a sidebar with a white background. All right, and the reason why is because um, it's basically just a styling uh, preference. Uh, I want to have a white background specifically behind these three social media icons, okay? All you have to do is go into the visual editor, all right? You go under leafs, click on add, widget ready sidebar, okay, I'm going to add that, all right? So it's right here, all right? Now what I want to do is I want to just note that the number of the sidebar is actually the ID is number 26. Okay, that's going to be important in just a minute. You'll see why. Um, so I did that. Then I want to resize it. Okay, and I know that the width on these is 300. I want to do exactly that. Okay, so I'm going to go 300. Okay, I'm going to make, you know, basically line it up to the right. Okay, just like these guys. All right, so it's all lined up, ready to go. Uh, I'm gonna click on save. So the next thing we wanna do is go into the editor. Underneath appearances, you click on editor. I wanna go into my custom style sheet, the custom.css file. We're gonna add a little bit of code. Um, and it will be, actually I had to change that leaf to 27, and it's going to be body.custom.number.leaf-27 space, um, you know, curly Q thing, background, colon, space, or FFFFFFF, semicolon, space, a curly Q thing, okay? So that's, that's the code right here, all right? And that's going to make that one leaf white in the background. Okay, so I'm going to click on update. The final thing is I'm going to go into the widgets. And you'll notice that there's another sidebar that just got added. That's that sidebar 27. All right. All I'm going to do is I'm going to take this social widget. I'm going to take it and move it right in here where I have that white background. And then I can uh, just leave it as is. And it's all set to go. So this is the final result right here. Okay. So see, we have a white background right here. And that's it. Pretty easy to do.